Welcome to my site code diaries, your ultimate guide to digital experience excellence, your go-to channel for all the things in Sitecore and .NET. This is the video from the series Sitecore Headless JSS and we are continuing the last video here. La in last video we have seen a layout service, dictionary service and other services, so the rest APIs basically. So we are going to have a demo today. I'm your host Jitendra Ghanekar. I'm in Sitecode Technology MVP 2024. And we have uh, Nikhil with us. He is going to guide us through this uh, uh, demo. Before handing over to Nikhil, I have provided all my uh, social media handles on the screen. You can follow me. You can ask me the question on my email ID. Till now, if you are not subscribed to the channel, please do consider subscribing to the channel and click on the notification bell. And if you are liking the video, please click on a like button and do share this with uh, your friends and colleagues. So let me hand over it to Nikhil uh, for today's demo. Hi guys, let's start with our uh, layout service and dictionary service demo. So we'll go. I'll show you first my headless layout. In the headless layout, I have selected two placeholders, JSS header and JSS main. I have created two renderings as well, first rendering and header. This is my home item in the presentation details. I have headless layout and two components. So as you know that layout service is structured content. So I'll show you the layout service. You can see this is a layout service of the same item of the home item. I'll go copy this. You see, this is the home item and the site name is Headless Demo. In this, we have placeholders as JSS header and JSS main as shown in the layout. You see, in the headless layout, we have selected JSS header and JSS main. I have created two inside feature, two placeholders. So we can see JSS header, JSS main. If I remove any one JSS main and just save it, see it is removed now. So let's add it back. So we can see this now, it is back again. We have two renderings, first rendering and the header. So as you can see in the presentation details, the first rendering is under JSS main and the header is JSS under JSS header. So you can see under JSS header, we have header and under JSS main, we have first rendering. So this is our layout service, structured content delivered via JSON API. This is called a layout service. Now let's start with our dictionary service. You see in the dictionary, I have created three entries, dictionary entry, it's a key value combination. So this is a key and this is the value. I have created mobile and language as you can see. This is our dictionary domain, site core API, JSS, dictionary, headless demo. And this is the language. So this is our site name and this is the language. This is the API key. So as you can see in the dictionary, we are getting the three values. If I go there and create something new called city and in the city and here I put a city. Let's reload it.
you see uh, the cities appeared now. So this is the dictionary. It is a key value pair. We generally use generic terms that are used across the site in dictionary. It's like this. So good day, guys. I hope uh, the layout service and the dictionary service concepts are now clear. The live demo shows that how the layout is getting delivered. The structure content is getting delivered through layout. That is a JSON API and uh, how the dictionary service is working, how we can create items in the dictionary and it will appear in the dictionary. So this is the dictionary service URL. Good day guys and hope you subscribe to the channel. Over to you G2. All right. Thank you Nikhil for this wonderful demo. I hope uh, you like this video. If you like this video, please click on a like button and do upload this video. Let the YouTube know that you are liking this video. Do share this video with your friends and colleagues. Uh, uh, you can share the complete playlist of Headless who is want to understand JSS Headless. You can share with them. Until now, if you are not subscribed to the channel, please do consider subscribing to the channel and click on that notification bell to get a latest update. Thank you. Thanks for watching.